RTV Unschool. Uh, in my opinion, a film school by defi definition is an educational institution running courses and teach film related subjects. But the context, the context of today's rapidly changing and advancing technologies, I strongly felt there is a need to relook at both the conventional and traditional methods of film teaching. The relevance of degree given by film institutes has been debatable. The point is that no one can teach a talented person. Almost one can work on steering that person and, and that's what uh, we propose to do in Unschool. So RGV himself never worked as an assistant director nor, I nor ever went to a film school. And yet he made trending, uh, trend setting films. In, it's his vast experience and his very specific understanding of cinema is what which we intend to both channelize and systemize at the Unschool. Unschool will be radically different and from all other film schools uh, while other schools teach this school will only make students unlearn. Unlearning tradition and conventional methods is what unschool is. To start with, I have to confess that uh, I was a very bad student in school. I failed twice in 10th standard, I failed twice in intermediate and I failed twice in engineering. So I think uh, it's very ironical that we are talking about RGB school. Though it's called unschool, its intention is to be school. See, right from the beginning of my career, for some reason, I never said that it is a media which invented this world, RGV school. And they kept on saying, this film looks like RGV school, or the director is from RGV school, or, or things like that, as RGV school, and shortly they stuff. I never ever really thought... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, filmmaking can be taught, you know, because uh, it is an expression of the person, how he wants to tell the story. So the idea for me here is, when I never ever had any training, and uh, many, there are many other directors like that. So what they are thinking from inside, an expression which converts into the various forms of uh, uh, cinematic art, whether it is camera work or music or whatever it is, you know. And when I met film institute students from all over the place, and not naming one particular institute, I felt they are just following very old classical patterns of uh, teaching. They uh, expect them to understand very old time directors. Uh, I mean, like Battleship, Potemkin. I'm not demeaning them. Of course, they were great films for the time. But I don't think cinema today is about what it was intended when it started. And there's a lot of comments involved. There's a lot of uh, people's expectations, a lot of people's expectations for various reasons. You know? So I think today it's a professional school course. It's not more, no more a passion, I mean, just passion about an art. It's not that. So I think it's equally important to understand what made the blockbuster work. That doesn't mean one school is going to teach how to make a blockbuster. But I think it's important to analyze it. It's important to, I mean, uh, kind of dissect it and make the students understand what do they want to do. Do they want to become uh, uh, an Eisenstein or do they want to become Rajmoli? Or do they want to learn from Citizen Kane? Or do they want to learn from PK, for example? So I think unschool will be very radical. It will be exactly doing the opposite of what uh, conventional film institutes uh, will be doing. You know? And that precisely comes from my thought process of not me wanting to teach or the unschool. I mean, uh, wants you to teach otherwise. When uh, Shweta used this word to make them unlearn, like instinctively people have something and then traditionally people try to make people understand something else. What you are thinking is ra wrong, you should think like this. You know, that is what schools do, that's what institutes do. But the unschool's point is to somehow make the students understand what their thinking is, right? And to only be able to tell them 
or guide them or steer them what it is about then uh, it obviously means is unschooled on another way you know i'll share an uh, small anecdote when in, in shiva when I, i broke many rules you know i didn't know even right left and right of camera sometimes when i was uh, directing my debut film so even my technicians used to tell nagarjuna and everyone that uh, he doesn't even know left and right how can he direct and he doesn't know the basics of fundamentals of uh, making you know and after the film work they said that's new age they said that's new age technique you know now why did they break the rules actually they didn't break the rules i didn't know the rules so when i didn't know the rules i just followed my heart and how i want to see it you know and that became uh, whatever it became you know so i similarly i think any story or any given thing different different filmmakers are going to treat it differently and their sensibilities will be different and their uh, way of wanting to capture will be different the taste and music will be different so the idea is to make them discover a filmmaker in themselves rather than trying to push a filmmaker into them no. any of the great filmmakers when you are in, when you are inspired or impressed or whatever uh, one thinks the bottom line is so the thing is one you can be impressed influence but you can also be impressed by very unknown director not necessarily what the institutes have determined as these are great directors these are because they got awards or they got something you can be inspired from a short film who nobody knows who made it you know so you are taking in things from whatever influence to and impress you and uh, you are trying to assimilate and absorb that so unschool will develop a process of doing that and system systemize it like what she said you know systemize and channelize a very radical and a very anarchic kind of thinking you know without having any rules and uh, any kind of a discipline any functions for example you know so because of my reputation if i am starting a school because i am i am first of all a rowdy you know someone called me a celluloid terrorist this <laughs> you know, is why i don't know but i i hope and i intend through the unschool to make uh, I mean, very, very individualistic. You know, when a lot of people say, only after RGV came, assistant directors started uh, sitting with them, and the Kalmi and Kalde school would be, you know, they develop an attitude and you know, arrogance and all that. Yeah. You know, now because I am attracting people who have an individual attitude. I hate that very slave-like culture which normally uh, people have. You know, so my uh, again coming back to this when. And there are so many institutes. Why start another institute? Institute? If anyone asks that question, precisely, I think the very title of the institute, and also the four lines which is written in terms of uh, professing its objectives itself will tell. This is going to be a, unlike anything anyone has uh, seen or experienced, and uh, in terms of. content generation or whatever it is i think it will uh, have methods which have never been heard of before all those details will be given in about 20 days in a website which will be uh, put up at a certain time you know and how the process will start and where it will be and all those details will come at a later stage but this press meet is uh, primarily intended for people to know about the idea and we are inviting people to apply on what kind of a uh, and criteria we require for people to apply and what will be the selection process based on what what needs to be so we are trying to gather those applicants so that we zero in on who in a sensibility or in a psychological pattern whatever the un school is looking for you know we want to choose the students what who we want to uh, be a part of the un school based on a certain examination you know and that is what the principal idea of this particular presentation is so any questions
You see, I feel the main principal crafts in our school will be acting, directing, some music, cinematography, editing, sound design. You know, any of the parts where you require a certain individualistic uh, I mean, approach and a point of view, how you want to use them as storytelling elements, all that will be a part of the unschool. Do you offer writing courses? It might happen in the later stage, not in the initial uh, courses. Because I feel writing, I, I feel writing for me is a point of the thing. A filmmaker himself should write. I somehow feel the writer should not be separate, especially when they call a cinema is a, I mean, it's a visual medium, and the sound and picture has to go together. And if the person who's writing cannot imagine the picture, I am fundamentally of this. Uh, belief that they cannot be separated. The director should be the writer. If at all he has a writer, I don't think it should be a part of the he's taking a professional writer. Yeah. When she first proposed idea for you know, starting the school, yeah. what was your initial reaction? Considering that you never I initially, you know, see, when she approached Shweta, she, uh, uh, she's not really from a film background or anything. I was first, first surprised, uh, you know, like she's based in New York, she does lots of fashion shows and things like that, you know. And I was always uh, against something like, uh, what do you call, to teach or uh, things like that. And I never saw myself, you know, because I used to sit in the back of the classroom and throw chalk pieces at my lecturers. That's, that's my only <laughs> experience in school. So for me to suddenly think of <coughs> me as uh, pretending to be a kind of a person who can make people learn, then she said, but uh, that is not what I'm asking you to do. I'm just asking you to be yourself. And that is different. And the way you look at films, the way you explain films, or the way what it means to you, is what the system of the unschool should be. You know, which is why it will be different from anything else. So because I'm traditionally against all film institutes and uh, the kind of teaching, I'm generally against education itself. You know? If at all somebody wants to do Stand before the mirror, why should he join unschool? Well, what, what? But that's the point. The unschool is going to teach how he can be himself, because most of the people don't seem to have that. See, if in 30 years I can't make you understand, as a journalist, what? What the fee structure is normal? Normal, what is the basic? See, we haven't come to the fee structure yet, because there's a lot of things being planned, uh, but the way it is completely done, and it will be, of course, different for different things in terms of, uh, because like I said, none of the method, none of them will be like what we con used to like hearing a six month score, one year course, or there could be, I mean probably there will be something like uh, only for the duration of one project. And that project can happen very fast or very soon depending upon the complexity of it, depending upon the person who is doing it, you know. So it, it will be very, it, it won't operate like six months, one year, two weeks, something can be only for two days maybe. I'm just giving an example, you know. So the whole, that is the reason it's being called unschooled. Nothing will operate like a school or an institute. All those details are being worked on, which will be shared very soon. See, today's time, I think it's, it's, not, it's not like classroom, it's not like, uh, the, of course, there will be a lot of physical interaction in places. It will happen at least in four different places, and uh, including the U.S. Yeah. Four different places. Hyderabad is included. Hyderabad, Bombay, and, and in New York, where she is, where New York, where she is from, and one other place we have yet to decide. Yeah. Would be closely associated with all the schools. Yeah. Where the near the near? Regular random and they see the point. Uh, the point is uh, when, when when I'm just releasing one uh, press note, Nikur Estanade. There are ten questions, so seven questions to be answered uh, for the to apply for this school, and uh, directly based on their answers, they'll be shortlisted, and then there'll be further exam. And they'll vote. <laughs> yeah. 
Actually, now that you asked me, uh, just as an example, I want to read a few questions what will be asked of uh, the applicants of uh, the school. I mean, I, not that uh, one will uh, so okay. Name 10 best films that you really <coughs> liked or were influenced by. This is to know the applicant's taste and sensibility. Name three of the worst films and write two or three lines on each of them and why you did not like them. This, the reasons will give a peek into the applicant's analytical intelligence. Cinema Hindu natural ledo and chapter on Gora Kale, natural ledo bound the ballet chatagam and again, Hindu natural ledo and chipping up blue, you will understand uh, the analysis power. You know, what is the last flop film you liked and why? You can bad cinema natural matter. Obviously, Thanke the current in Manga Villu, you know, Uda and the Ag natural one of good culture, okay, culture. Ag, Ag cinema natural good over culture. When I photo with Kuni, no, when I photo with Kuni, they would button this is a bit Kuni. Hmm? What is the last flop film you liked and why? This is to test the degree of intelligence in one's honesty. And they flops and are not in the Hindu, not in the day, honest. Obviously, that is a criteria you are looking for uh, in the person. What is the last hit film you hated and why? This is to test how strongly one is opinionated. Can you mention one scene in any film which you think has been very well directed and give your reasons? This will test how much one actually understands directing. Shala Bala directs his hair and but direction and tells us in first two. That's the point. And then if you were to shoot Satya now, after uh, 20 years, to today's available technology, in cameras you just though, and how many days? So today in the internet, everybody knows how films are made. They see the making and uh, many people make independent films. So even before coming to the institute, does he really have some understanding of how films are made? Our practicality, and this question is designed for that. No. As a first attempt, what kind of film would you like? to make and why this is to understand a degree of one's <coughs> ambition so kotta ga ochchadu nenu bahubali chestana vastada you know my ambition is to make bahubali ante chaala chaala ambitious you know and uh, then why and adiginappudu he left to answer nenu rajmouli ganna better an anukuntu antada ante appudu dan batti adu e antasthu lo unnadu telustadi you know Question we will have a second legal question. And even was the Papa Rajmoli Kerry in a pottery. Rajmoli Pottakotan was the industry of the. So there will be a lot of these kind of things happening to provoke and, uh, I mean, what do you call, uh, provocate a certain thing to get to know the real inside of him. And in this selection process, they will be carefully taken out. You know? So these are some of the questions, whatever uh, I said, just to give an example. Yeah, huh. yeah. Faculty is shorter than the chance to try and the chance Faculty? What? People who teach different schools. Exactly teaching. See, uh, that, is, that is exactly the point. They won't be teachers. Yeah. This, see, there will be, I am, it will be a very, very interactive kind of a, uh, I mean, uh, process, you know. There will be a very, very one-to-one -one level in terms of in interaction and all that. It is not like you're putting a bunch of people there. You know, it will be almost like a, uh, I mean, it doesn't sound right in a moral sense, but the nearest example I can give, which is like a terrorist outfit. It is like a radical terrorist, Thorabora Mountains, like one of them. No, I'm not saying about the place. The point is, it's like a, to teeth, I mean, to imagine each individual as a separate filmmaker, you know, and there could be the interaction will be at most on a one-to-one, -one, maybe on a personal, physical level, or on giving in a project. You know, if you have a cell phone, 
if I, if we ask him to just take whoever you want and give me two minute short film and only use the cell phone somebody might be given uh, something as uh, complex as a visual effects film and ask him to that, that that is when i said the projects might differ in terms of what you know so everything will be taken independently as a project work by itself like a, you're giving a contract out to that to that particular thing and unschool will be providing the information which he might not have you know a guidance which he might not have in some issues you know because any person who has passion can come and join the unschool you know and if you pro and if if you go back a little to schooling for example four years i was in engineering college so i'm i'm supposed to be civil engineer because i have a degree and i don't know the mixture of uh, cement concrete but i have a degree so it could point in and there when when you go to an institute they will commonly teach everybody something which people might not be interested me interest in when i get first i interest but in need this than gani you who are in which kolan gona in japan that that for me is the fundamental difference between our school and any other school so which is the reason i am saying this system is be geared for teaching on almost a one to one level and one to one in the classroom either under the nantle you should not imagine it as a classroom to start with that's the whole point but those details will come to know uh, later what is the motor sir because motor thing motor is to i want to make lot of terrorists and uh, into the lead them into the film industry <laughs> I want to create <laughs> lot of terror. Huh? No, no, no. I don't want to create Varma. Varma is just one of them. But I believe there are thousands of people who think like me. They're just not able because they don't want to go through the whole process of it, and they're lost. That's why under me, all over the country, the picture of Chetko gun is just made of dust. Sir, school level training of playing a black person, he told us. So, after hours, I went to school. It's cool, hundred percent. Hours on day, see, bro. Even I had a school. Now, school ended. That's the whole thing I'm saying. I was not born with some talent or knowledge. I learned something in the theaters. I learned something in the in the people I met. That they, uh, because my uncle was a film buff, and he happened to be taking me to a lot of films. So, every person will have different experiences. Every person will have. Uh, Uh, his own sensibility you know his own iq level prati okariki vere untu kada vati each of them has to be taken separately as a case study which is the reason i said in the education lo i feel as education enduku ane first nerpichar ad nerpichukona chadu paata nechuko exam rase nika enni marks raavali ante what is it nonsense why do you need to be educated you should understand first you know so i did that whole process something because my cinema is something my subject and i i have 30 years of experience good bad ugly and flop films and hit films whatever i made out of all that experience i systemized it not to teach but to make people unlearn like this huh? the course i put in 30 years to age kon experience if you can manage to give it to the unschool for a person on day one he obviously can develop from that he doesn't need to go through mental experience వాడుకుంటారు <laughs> 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 ఆడ దగ్గర టాలెంట్ ఉందని తెలిస్తే ఆడికి తెలిసే లోపల నేను ప్రొడ్యూస్ చేసి డబుల్ చేసుకుంటా పూర్ స్టూడెంట్ అని చెప్పారు కానీ మీ క్వాలిఫికేషన్ రాదు ఫస్ట్ అలాగే అడుక్కునే మెంటాలిటీ ఉంటే మా దగ్గరికి రావద్దు పూర్ స్టూడెంట్ డిపెండ్ అపాన్ దట్ స్పెసిఫిక్ థింగ్ అదర్ స్కూల్స్ 
See, that directly will depend upon each project and that is more, I think, Shweta Reddy's uh, prerogative because I am just the creative head and not into administration and, and the financial part. Yeah. We'll work on it and get back. <laughs> Are you, are you going to teach? Me? Yeah. I am going to unteach. Teach and a word, I have a problem. I only want to talk, I'll tell you, honestly, I, I only will talk about my flops. I won't talk about my hits in this. Uh, in this. In the end, it will unchoose it all. It will be in the end. flop this, you know, I am a talented director. I know what flop is this, you know, I am a talented director. They will understand from that more than my hit films. Yen cewa orang tu nace ko nace ko entah ni betul. Yen cewa orang tu cuci sinema normal yang kan jepe ni. Ni nak rosu Shiva sinema di sana pulo. Anje pernah ni orang ni udara. Shiva tu tuan sih sendu di sana. Dan tuan sih you will learn more. Enzo, you got your point. Thanks. Hello, this is your Nandu. Please do subscribe to New Waves Media. இலான்டி மரின்னி மன்சி வீடியோலு காவாலனி கோருக்குண்டு நாரா? ஐதே, பக்கனே உன்ன கண்டு சிம்பல்னும் கலிக்க்கு செய்யின்டி. அலகே, சப்ஸ்கரிப் செய்யின்டி.